Hey there! Welcome back to Make Sure Excel. Today we'll be going over the easiest way to set up MR Ticket Three in Unity. First, let's get MR Ticket Three official examples from GitHub. Make sure you select the branch MR Ticket Three and click on Download Zip. After unzip the file, let's launch it in Unity. Click on Add, choose the unzipped folder, and navigate to Unity Project. Select on MRTK Dev Template. Click Open. Don't worry, the template project is using an older version of Unity. I've tested out that it works perfect fine with the newer version. Choose Android platform and click on Open. Trust me and click on Change version. Then click on Continue. Let's open up an example scene in Unity. There is a lot of examples you can play around with. It's under Asset Scenes. For this one, I'm using Hand Interaction example. Here, just agree to import Text Mesh Pro. Now, let's take a look at what are the main components here. We have MRTK XR Rig. XR Rig is basically users' eyes, ears, hands in the virtual world. We also have Mixed Reality Scene component, which is the parent object of all the interactables in the scene. Now that we have everything in the scene, let's go ahead to modify the project setting. Go to Edit, Project Setting, XR Plugin Management. Under Android tab, making sure OpenXR is selected and uncheck Google Air Core. Go to PC tab, making sure OpenXR is selected. Go to OpenXR, under Android tab, Interaction Profile, making sure Oculus Touch Controller Profile is selected. If not, click on the Add button to add the profile. Under OpenXR Feature Group, make sure Hand Tracking, MetaQuest Support, and Motion Controller Model is selected. Go to PC tab, under Interaction Profile, add MetaQuest Touch Pro Controller Profile. Oculus Touch Controller Profile and Hand Interaction Profile. Under Open XR Feature Groups, select Hand Tracking and Motion Controller Model. Setting up Open XR for PC is not necessary. However, our setup allows us to test in play mode directly in Quest using Hand Tracking and Touch Controller. Now let's test it out in play mode. Open Oculus Desktop App. Then, making sure a headset is connected to your PC via cable or through AirLink. Go back to Unity and click Play. If it's not showing up in your headset, restart Unity. After rebooting Unity, click on Play again and it should work as expected. This is a recording directly from Quest in Play mode. You can see both touch controller and hand tracking is working perfectly. It's finally the time to build to the quest. Go to File, Build Setting, making sure it's set to Android platform. Select Desired Location and click on Build. After the build is finished, open MetaQuest Developer Hub. Under Device Manager, click on Add Build. Select the APK we just built. After installing the app, let's open it up in Quest. Go to App Library. Under the drop down, select Unknown Sources. Your app should show up there. Have fun with MRTK3. Thanks for watching. Peace out.